Hello, everybody. Come on. Test. Okay, so it's about a 10 second delay, and my internet is not wanting to cooperate today. However, I will do my best as possible. Um, I'm gonna keep it on pilot. Uh, I hope everyone's having a wonderful day today. Um, give me one second, I gotta make sure people know I'm online. Because I keep forgetting to do that, and I wonder why nobody shows up. Yeah, I've recently gotten to Destiny 2, and that's kind of been fun. Um, but, yeah. Uh, there's So, last time we uh, did that fucking traverse mission, um, and we had to uh, disable a starship, and we tested out the Starhawk, which was very bad for the Imperials, and then we also did a raiding mission uh, to protect Imperial assets from the New Republic. And re refit our ship to fight the Starhawk. So, uh, that's where we're starting. Let's go. I hope we've all had a fantastic day so far today. Sorry, I haven't streamed in a while. It's been, I've been on a very depressing road. Uh, and right now I'm trying to find ways to cope. But, such is life. There's ups, there's downs, there's streams, there's not streams. Eh, it's just the way the world works. Honestly, I've been debating with myself whether I should even continue streaming. Because nobody really watches me or gets entertained. But, eh, it's fine. I'll stream when I can, as much as I can. Grey, Soul, how are you? Amos, Gram. We keep running into fools who forget what side they're on. See, this is why we need a new Imperial Senate. Someone who can keep these idiots in check. We have a war to win. Officers like Grom need direction, not a leash. Looking to the horizon is all very well, Saul. But remember to look at what's going on around you. With that Beradium at our disposal, we'll be at the forefront of the attack on the Nadiri dockyards. Oh, we got caught off guard at the Xavian Abyss. That can't happen again. In one move, Captain Carroll took us from a near shipwreck to a key military asset. She'll have a plan. Let's see what's next. A big fight, I assume. Is that all? No one else to talk to? Alright, let's go to the briefing. Our victory is nearly at hand. We have the location of the Nadiri dockyards, and the Overseer is almost back to full strength. Our only obstacle now is Vanguard Squadron. 
I won't let them catch us off guard. Not again. Admiral Sloan has a plan to draw Vanguard Squadron and other defenders away from the Nadiri dockyards. The Admiral has ordered Titan Squadron to play a part, and she wants you to take the lead. For this mission, at least. I trust okay. Admiral Sloan's decision. You've proven yourself capable many times over. Just don't let it go to your head. It would be a pity if you I never do. like Colonel Graham. Oh, I won't. I'll probably probably be dead. I flounder through most of the missions. I'm not a very good pilot. Our Baradian munitions give us the firepower to take on the Starhawk, but the situation isn't that simple. The Nadiri dockyards are protected by a massive rebel fleet. We cannot engage the Starhawk until it is vulnerable. Admiral Sloan's strategy is simple. Lure the Republic fleet away from Nadiri with simultaneous attacks on enemy targets across the galaxy. We've been assigned to attack Moncala. We don't have the numbers for a pitched battle, so you will have to strike fast. Your mission is to sow chaos through multiple attacks, moving quickly. These refueling pods are your first target. Next, attack civilian transports and any medical frigates supporting them. This will certainly draw out Anvil Squadron who are defending Moncala. Stay ahead of them if you can. Titan 3, you're ready for more responsibility. You will lead the assault. Make oh, please no. And brutal. They've earned it. Don't make me lead. This is not a good idea. I'm telling you, Captain, it's not a good idea. And while Titan attacks Moncala, two battle groups will launch strikes at Onderon and Gorse, disrupting Republic supply lines. Ah, at ease, pilot. Reports of your achievements have crossed my desk with unusual frequency. Those accolades have been well earned, Admiral. If Titan Squadron's a weapon, our newest pilot is its cutting edge. Just as I'd hoped. Then consider Let's probably lower it down to story pilot. Great talent requires greater challenges. Agreed, Admiral Sloan. And I look forward to filing my next commendation report. I'm going to overlook your unapproved acquisition of Colonel Grom's beradium supply. Although I hope you both learned something from that encounter. Colonel Grom is efficient. After all, he did successfully defend his depot without using any of his own resources. But an Imperial officer must also show finesse if they are to command effectively. We understand, Admiral. Completely. That will be all. Yes, ma'am. To the hangar. No one to talk to. Gray. Seeing you rise to the occasion, taking lead on this mission, it reminds me why I keep fighting. Despite my age, despite the fatigue, we're one step closer to the Starhawk. Ride this confidence, but don't let arrogance get the best of you. We're all expendable. But not every pilot is replaceable. When we lose a good leader or loyalist, you can't fill the void with just anyone. Good pilots inspire those above and below them. When you're in charge of a squadron someday, remember that. I now shall do my best, Greg. Yes. <sighs> Anvil Squadron. What up, Shan? Been a while. They shot you me fought down them before, once. I see. Lost two vertebrae that time. Seeing Anvil burn. Might ease some pain. Overseers fixed. Good. Superstructure was groaning. Kept me awake. Implants, your metal stresses. Handy in combat. Other times. Wing. Been watching the mouse droids. They always why? seem scared. Wonder well, why. Yeah. Time because they're built that way. Uh, as much as I hate to think about it, I I do think I'm gonna have to go down to story mode.
You know what? We've been going so so far on pilot. Let's let's finish the game at least on you're pilot. You're authorized to fly a Tie Fighter, Reaper, or Interceptor. Your choice. Hmm. I learned my lesson last time. Let's see what we got. So a burst cannon. We'll keep the standard. Uh, proton torpedo. Eh, I think we can find seeker warheads. Sensor jam. Let's see. Increased hull integrity, but turning and changing speeds takes a lot. I think you'll be happy with it. Yeah. yeah, well, we better be. Max speed and stop quickly, great for outflying enemies. Hit and run. Hit and run. Alright. I think we'll be okay. Let's fucking go! Fueling pods. Mon Cala, one of the Republic's key shipyards. So quiet. Perfect target. Show no mercy, Titan. Sowing terror and outrage here means victory at Nadiri. Your first target is the refueling pods in orbit. Focus on. Remember, yeah. enemy starfighters are patrolling this system. Move quickly and cut down any interference. Let's yep. get started. Lead on three. Come on, come on. Closer, closer. And. Swing of an
Oh, what the fuck? Die, please. I've lost control. Uh. Taking fire. I can't fucking turn for shit. They're locking on to me. I'm just going to restart the mission and um, switch my loadout. Because that. That's going to. Oh! No, 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 no. Is there a way for me to, like, switch out of this loadout? Because I cannot turn for crap. Show no mercy, Titan. Sowing terror and outrage here means victory at Nadiri. Oh. Your first target is the refueling pods in orbit. Just target one. Remember, is. enemy starfighters are patrolling this system. Move quickly and. Actually. Cut down any interference. Let's get started. Lead on, three. Should hit, right? Blow up, blow up, blow up. Time. Let's get those fuel pods. Fucking die. Come on. 
bitch. Oh. God damn it. Not being able to turn is just garbage. How the fuck am I going faster than they are? Whatever. Fucking turn. It said it'd be, it'd be harder to turn. I didn't think it meant impossible. They are locking on to me. Die! Return to the hangar. Return, just return to the hangar. I've got to change out my loadout because not being able to turn is just garbage of the highest order. Man, I'm slowly learning what's good and what's not in this game. Ah. <laughs> uh. Oh my god, it's making me do all this over. Okay, fuck it. Amos. See, this is what we have a looking. Don't care, we don't care, don't care, don't care, don't care, don't care, don't care. I've already been through all this. Our victory is nearly at hand. I skip. Our Baradian munitions. Let's go. The Nadiri Doc. Admiral skip, skip, Sloan, skip, 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 skip. Your mission. Next, this will serve. Yes, 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 yes. I know, I know, I know, no. And while Titan attacks Moncala, come on, come on, come on. Then consider. Agreed. I'm going to open. Colonel, but we understand. Can we go now, please? Thank you. It'll be ready. Oh, no didn't mean hit that. There we go. Come on, skip, 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 skip. Anvil Squadron. Skip, 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 skip. Time to go. Prepare to launch. Let's talk modifications. Yeah, let's. No. Uh, trade hall integrity. Yeah, we'll just keep using that. Thrust engine's fine. That'll be fine. Launch. I would use the interceptor, but I've learned my lesson. The interceptor is not meant for frigate combat. <sighs> Oof. 
Sorry, guys. And now, we go destroy. Moncala. One of the Republic's key shipyards. So quiet. Perfect target. Show no mercy, Titan. Sowing terror and outrage here means victory at Nadiri. Your first target is the refueling pods in orbit. Remember, enemy starfighters are patrolling this system. Move quickly and cut down any interference. Let's get started. Mad. Lead on, three. Closer, closer. Granted, Shen. Certainly. Enemy starfighters approaching. Imperial invaders. This is Anvil Squadron. Leave Moncala immediately or face the consequences. Frigates, huh? Textbook shooting. Taking fire. I'd say you only want see. Come on. You won't stop me. Big mistake. Much better. Hello there. They're behind you. Yeah, I know. I know they're behind me. Motherfuckers just circling around. the A-Win. But man, you are just an asshole to deal with, huh? Fucking get back here and stop turning around like an idiot. You're 
this a wing is just this a wing man fucking just die just come here and die please oh. Hello, where did you come from? So, I need to reach my...
trash can. Kill it. Ah, come on. Why am I doing such little damage to these fucking things? This is Anvil Leader requesting immediate reinforcements to my location. Whatever, I guess we won't take on the frigates. They will feel that loss keenly. I've got our laser cannons warp. I'm done. Ready for whatever's next. Move on. It's just bullshit. That fucking you lay into this thing for minutes on end and it just doesn't fucking die. Not to mention your allies don't fucking attack the goddamn thing. What the fuck is that bullshit? And New Republic flagship, I assume. Titan 3. Those transports are our next target. Looks like Anvil Squadron is already here. Titan Squadron, these ships are under our protection. Leave now or be destroyed. There's a third way, Anvil. You won't like it. Cut through those Anvil defenders and destroy the transports. Confirmed. Those transports are fleeing towards Moncala's planetary defenses. They only delay the inevitable. Should be dead. Transport is down. And the squadron has called in reinforcements. Incoming now. You've made an impression, Titan. Finish off those transports or push forward to the next target. It's your call, three. Attacking civilians. How much lower can the Imperials sink? This is so precious. Let's press on when you're ready. Two more. We must destroy all these little scum. Transport is done for. One more. They're very fun to destroy. Come on, get there. Get there faster. We'll make Anvil Squadron. I have your back. Come on. I am the leader. Bam. Three's unstoppable today. Let's keep this going. Next objective is up. Let's move. Ignore Anvil. They're nothing to us. Are we done? Almost time for the main event. Resupply. If you would. Thank you. 
You know what? Let's finish off. And squash, shall we? Let's teach them a lesson. Get in our way? Fine. But you will be, folks. Ah! Where did that come from? Where is... And... Where the fuck are these starfighters that are just kicking my ass? Ah, whatever. We'll leave here. I'm going to die. Medical frigates now. Our next target is that medical frigate. A medical frigate? Is it carrying patients? No. Back to Ed Stims. But losing medical supplies in wartime is far more devastating. Damage. 
Cargo ships destroyed the medical frigate. No mercy. Uh, yeah. The burning wreckage of Moncal and other key sites across the galaxy will lure the New Republic's fleet away. Your path to the Jerry Dockyards is open. Just no mercy whatsoever. Destroy the medical frigate. Obliterate everyone. Oh, come on. Commended. Really, headache? Not now. The hero who led the scouring of Moncala. That's a sort of accolade that gets people's attention. Makes them listen to what you have to say. If I were in your position, I'd be thinking about what that newfound prestige could be used for when the war's over. Just a suggestion. Let's find out what ah, I'll be fine. next. I'll retire. Go to a nice backwater planet somewhere where no one will be able to find me. Divert Cess. The Vanguard Squadron has left the Nadiri dockyards to aid Moncala, leaving the Starhawk completely exposed. We now have a clear shot to finish our mission. Admiral Sloan has sent reinforcements to help secure our victory. But you, Titan Squadron. We'll lead the strike against the Starhawk. If New Republic patrols and perimeter defenses intercept you on approach, show them no mercy. Before we begin our Baradium assault, you must bring down the dockyard's shields. We've discovered shield generators at these locations. Destroy them all, and the Overseer's bombardment will begin. After the shield generators are down, Titan III will return to the Overseer to acquire Baradium-enhanced munitions. This is where we show our true strength. Immobilize the Starhawk with Baradium. Do not stop until its hyperdrive is destroyed. I want that ship 
helpless when I deliver the killing blow. Let's make Admiral Sloan proud. Hmm. I might actually have to stop after just that one mission because I'm my fucking headaches come back. So, uh, you, Captain Carroll's tenacity hate it. and your hard work have made this possible. Of course, mere numbers aren't enough to win a battle. But I'll give you the best moment-to-moment -moment analysis that I can. The Beradium will be at your disposal for the crucial moment I've seen to it. The rest is in your hands. Unfortunately, we cannot issue you Beradium munitions from the get-go. With the enemy shields up, there's a high probability that missiles will be lost in the crossfire. Or a pilot. Either would be quite devastating. Gray asked me about the Starhawk's tractor beam, but don't worry. That won't be a factor in this battle. With the Starhawk, its tractor beam would endanger the dockyards and everyone stationed there. The rebel's squeamishness gives us the advantage. Good luck. Not a factor I can predict, sadly. You'll be fine. Thank you, LT. Captain Carroll. Before us is a historic victory. If we have the metal to seize it. The Beradium, the Overseer, even our TIE fighters are only tools. What decides a battle is our will to conquer. That's what the rebels have never understood. If we hold to that principle, we can crush the Starhawk and win the day. We've successfully drawn off the rebel forces protecting the Nadiri dockyards. Only a token defense remains. And the Starhawk. No doubt the rebels believe the Starhawk is all the protection they need. They have no idea what Alberadium is about to do to their defender. Get ready. It's time. Indeed it is. I feel like this can only go well. <laughs> uh, I want to try and push through the headache and just do one more mission. Tell me you're not forcing me into a bomber. You know this attack is about more than the Starhawk, Vanguard, or even the Dockyards. It represents a strike at everything this new Republic represents. What they think they gained at Endor. New Republic. Even the name's a joke. The Republic has never been anything but 10,000 squabbling voices. Though after this, they'll be screaming in unison. Let's show the New Republic for the sham it really is. Hey, Shen. Hey, Gray. It's clear the Captain trusts you. Leading the Beradium strike against the Starhawk is a big responsibility. You've more than proved you're capable. Agreed. The path has been long, but I'm proud to fly with both of you. What's next? After the war? I've been at this a long, long time. I'll retire. Maybe somewhere quiet, near the water. My husband would be happy anywhere without Dura steel walls at this point. What about you, Shen? This is what I do. I'm needed here. War or not. Fair enough. Time to go. I'll probably retire. Or drag Shen along with me somewhere. <sighs> Please don't want to get a choice. Consider outfitting nope. your bomber to handle new Republic fighters as well as their capital ships. Your loadout is looking good. It'll be even better once we're cleared to give you beradium explosives. Uh, also deals less damage. High sustained damage or worried about missing. Yep. Multi lock missile. Okay. Assault shield. Proton bombs. 
Deals very high damage, but you have to get close. A Goliath missile? Ooh. And a proton torpedo. Well, let's do a proton bomb. And a beam cannon? Hold it and fire a high damage beam that lasts for a few moments. Your ship can barely turn while the beam is active. Ideal versus capital ships. Okay. Seeker warheads. Sensor jammer. Go ahead and use Seeker Warheads. Uh, enemies take longer to lock on you, but you have less hull integrity. Counters lock on weapons, just tractor beams and missiles. Um, I don't like this, but we're probably going to be taking a lot of incoming fire. Decreases max speed, but your ship now generates boost if any power is in engines. The more power, the faster it generates. Uh, let's do slam. That'll be great for running away. Alright, let's try this loadout. Okay. Three ties, a bomber, and a reaper. This is it, Titan Squadron. Everything we've done has led to this. Bask in the moment, and then massacre your enemy. We're looking forward to it, Captain. General Sindula to Imperial forces, you are trespassing in New Republic space. Leave immediately. This is Captain Carroll of the Overseer. Your Starhawk dies today, as will you. Titan Squadron, attack! With pleasure. All turrets open fire on those ships. Your meager defenses cannot stop us. Ooh. Titan, eliminate all turrets. Let's give the Overseer a clear path to the Star. Got a decent amount of fire, too. As fast as I can, guys. Hello, Missile Launcher. Goodbye, Missile Launcher. Wait, it says there's still one more. But where? Titan, oh, boy. 
Telling you is there. Wow, I'm loving this cannon. Ow. Where's the other missile launcher? Not, but well, there's a Starhawk. No, just a hanger. I don't see any more uh, missile launchers. Honestly, I don't know where the last missile launcher is. Uh, where's the map? Uh, well, I mean, if they want me to. You've made a terrible mistake, sir. I just, I don't know where the other missile pod would be. I don't see it. I mean, unless I'm blind, but. Destroy the objectives. I don't... I don't see... Ah! Hello, you! Fuck off. Regroup and prepare for the assault. It's time. Meridium has made contact with the Dockyard Shields. This won't take long. Titan, we need to fly past that Starhawk to hit their generators. It won't be a problem. All units report in. You're wasting your breath. They're dead. James told me about you, Tourista. Violence follows wherever you go. Fostar Haven, Hosnian Prime, Deceveral, Moncala. History will remember what side you chose. History has no sides. Only survivors. Our shields will hold. Only as long as we let them. Titan, destroy the dockyard shield generators. Understood. Let's go, buddy. I'm, I'm ready when you are, Gray. Like... Uh... Is this a glitch? Gray? Okay, well, whatever.
Oh, now, now you want... What the fuck are you doing, Gray? I mean, it's not letting me do anything until... He moves, so... Do I have to restart? I assume so. That's slightly. Oh. The has made contact with the dockyard shields. This won't take long. Titan, we need to fly past that Starhawk to hit their generators. It won't be a problem. All units report in. You're wasting your breath. They're dead. James told me about you, Teresa. Violence follows wherever you go. Fostar, Haven, Hosnian Prime, DeSevril, Moncala. History will remember what side you chose. History has no sides. Only survivors. Our shields will hold. Only as long as we let them. Titan, destroy the dockyard shield generators. Understood. All right, so let's get to, to go, shall we? Go? Useful. Uh, that boost doesn't go away. Very helpful to escape. Oh boy. Here we go. Ooh, so that's boy. their Starhawk battleship. For now, soon that monstrosity will be a wreckage. I'm here, let's go. Ah. Oh, I don't like this. Die. You're clear. The first shield generator is down. Get the rest. Enemy behind you, stay sharp. Die. Another generator destroyed. Good. Do that. I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. Wait, is for the hangers now? That should keep their fighters off our backs. Okay, but where's the other one? I like I'm going as fast as I can, but... There we are. 
still say there's more hangings. Oh, oh god. I don't see any. Oh, this doesn't have a, uh... Man, I wish I'd been able to choose a repair module. This is not good. <sighs> Why can't bombers have a repair module? Oh yeah, that's right, because that would make sense. Okay. Yeah, no, my headache's not good, and this is just not helping my case. Alright, well. We will stop there for today.